The National Inland Waterway Authority says their preliminary investigation has revealed that the boat Misha at uh, Patigi local government area of Kwara State, which claimed over 100 lives, was due to some avoidable human errors. The managing director of Niwa, Jod Mogalu, said this in a lorry shortly after visiting the affected community to commiserate with the locals. He noted that the affected vessel was traveling at around 2.30 a.m., conveying over 200 people without live jacket. While the engine of the boat was weak, a development he said was blatantly against the protocols of Niwa. We share the pain of the loss, which preliminary investigations have confirmed was actually a consequence of human error that was avoidable if the basic protocols were followed. From the report we have received so far, though the investigations are still ongoing, showed very clearly that the vessel involved in the accident was on water at a very unholy hour. That's about 2.30 a.m. in the morning. And there is a standard protocol that after 6 p.m. we don't allow vessels to operate on our waterways because experience has shown that over 90 to 95 percent of the accidents that happened on our waterways happen either in the night or very hours, very early hours of the morning. Mogalu, however, maintained that the agency was already taking steps to prevent a reoccurrence of such incidents in the future. Our target is not only to know what has happened, but at the same time also to stem any such happening again in the future. I spoke with the community. I drew their attention to all this, which they shared with me. They agreed with me. And then we are now looking at how we can avoid such in the future. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.